you have this list of all these unmet needs that you start to find. You're having these conversations with clinicians. You're understanding your total addressable market. There's a possibility there. What, this is a fun side path. What else was in your top three to top five that you couldn't pursue in order to focus on this? And how did you make that decision? That's such a good question. What were the ones in our top three to five? There is another one that we had for orthotics because orthotics can be really frustrating and just making sure that you get them in time and, and the whole fitting process. So it was more of a, that one wasn't as much of like an engineering innovation as it would have been like a systemic innovation. Mm -hmm. um, so we put that one on pause. There were a couple in the, um, I'm going to forget exactly what the problems were, but it was in the ENT space. So there is a certain, I want to say it was a nose surgery and just the way that they have to do the surgery is very challenging when you get, sorry if anyone's screaming. No, I love you this. You're fine. Right up, into, my world. <laughs> right up into the nasal cavity. Um, and so we were trying to think of ways that we could make that a lot easier. Um, there was another one in the eye. So on, on, I can't say the word very well. You can't say prosthetist very well. I can't say the <laughs> uh, op ophthalmology. Okay. Um, there was like a ophthalmological, I guess, um, issue in the eye. And so coming up with something for that. So there were a bunch of different ones. And really what it came down to is even just like skill set on the team. So for example, the eye one, that would be really heavy on the biomaterial side mm -hmm. of engineering. The orthotics one is a lot more systemic. So that's more really just like a um, an online or a not an app, but like, like a, a SaaS solution. A SaaS yeah. solution. A SaaS solution. Um, so there's all these different, but we just got so passionate about having this like mechanical hardware. Something you could touch with your engineering background and the biomechanics. Yeah. Because I majored in mechanical engineering. I leaned into the biomedical spaces, but I ended up going mechatronics just based on robotics. So I I understand how you can get that spark of this is a problem I, within my space like i can have dominion over crafting a new solution here exactly if i iterate through it aggressively enough 